Hello guys, welcome. This is 100 Days of Coding Challenge tutorial. Today, today is day 16. In this tutorial, we are going to solve permutation cipher. This problem is found on code signal website. You can check out and you can solve this problem by your own. Okay, the permutation cipher is a cryptographic concept. Uh, it is a transposition cipher in which the key is a permutation. To apply a, a permutation cipher, a random permutation uh, of size E is generated. The larger the uh, value of E, the more secure the cipher. So that is uh, in general a cryptographic co uh, concept. And uh, in this problem, we are going to solve uh, uh, encrypting the password using permutation cipher. The problem definition is you found your very first laptop in the Audic and decided to give into nostalgia and turn it on. The laptop turned it out uh, to be password protected, but you know how to crack it. You have always used the same password, but encrypt. So the output should be permute uh, that takes the password and the key as input and it's going to generate encrypted password by permutating or by transposition transposing the password the given password by the key that is called a permutation cipher so our target is just uh, write a solution to solve this problem that's going to encrypt the password in this case uh, this is the function definition and it takes two parameters, that is the password and the key. And our target is how to write uh, the solution for this problem. Actually, in this uh, case, I'm going to use a make trans method. The string method that is a string, I mean, str dot make trans that takes uh, the input, for example, abc and B, C, D. This is going to return a mapping. Uh, this uh, make trans uh, is uh, the a string method that's going to return a mapping table that can be used with translate method. So this uh, mapping uh, table for translation usable for translate method, and it is a static method. Uh, uh, method that, that can create a one-to-one -one mapping of a character to its translation or replacement. For example, in this case, uh, for example, this is a given password and this is a key, let us assume, and it creates a mapping, a one-to-one -one mapping. Uh, for example, the A in, uh, in the numeric representation of the A is 97. Uh, the second uh, argument of the first letter is 98, and it creates just like this until the end of all the characters. So this is the, the most important method that uh, creates a mapping uh, that's going to use uh, for translation to replace the password with the key. So in this case, uh, what about, there is another method uh, because we are going to just replace the given password, the, I mean, uh, the key, we are going to create a mapping of the all alphabets starting from A to Z uh, uh, by uh, uh, using the a key, the given key. So we are going to use uh, a string method. This string method, uh, has the ASCII characters. Uh, and instead of writing each small letter uh, character in a variable, we can just use string ASCII lowercase. This takes all the lower cases starting from A to Z. So we are going to just replace here string dot ASCII lowercase. And Let's take the key from the given example.
and we are going to create a mapping. You see, it creates the first character uh, in the alphabet is mapped with the first character uh, in the given key. That is a mapping. And the translation going to translate this uh, given uh, uh, the table into uh, encrypted password using the password, the given password. All right. Uh, let's create this. This is a table. Uh, in this case, uh, okay, let's copy this inside this function. And our target is, for example, uh, let's take the password. The password. Here's the password. And we're going to use a translate method that's going to translate password dot translate and we pass the table here. This is going to return. This is the encrypted password uh, as you can see here. So uh, it's going to return, I mean, uh, password dot translate that takes the mapping from uh, table and we can, now we call the function permute and we pass the password and the key and it generates the encrypted password. So this is uh, the cipher, uh, permutation cipher. Uh, we can encrypt, so in this case, you can uh, crack down the password, the locked password of the laptop, and you can use it using this permutation ciphers using simple Python program. So this is day 16, and you can watch uh, starting uh, from day one up to day 15, and you can also uh, register and participate in uh, code signal website. There are a lot of uh, problems available on code signal website. Thanks for watching now.